Welcome to episode 824 of Apartment Hacker. This is Mike Burden, Apartment Hacker. It's my mission to tease out human potential in the multifamily space. What do you feel when you go into an Apple store if you're an Apple uh, fan or fanatic? Um, if you've ever been in there, whether you own an Apple phone or not, I'm, my imagination tells me that many of you have been into an Apple store. Um, if you've never been in, please go in so you can uh, get this point. When you go into an Apple store, it feels like... Uh, a very inviting space, a space that you want to stick around, a space you want to be in, a space you want to hang out in, and you're kind of welcome there, right? Um, versus, let's say, uh, a bank or some place where you go in to do transactional type uh, things, where you're walking in and you're just getting your business done and you're walking right back out. You don't feel really welcome there. You're just there to do a transaction, and it's uh, it's interesting to me and it's striking to me in the sense that many of our uh, business offices, uh, our leasing centers uh, in the multifamily space, while they do feel like living rooms, they many times are handled in transactional ways. In other words, it's, it's not an experience where someone comes in and feels like they want to stay, uh, and many times neither do we, we really treat them like we want them to stay, uh, but rather they're, they're places where you just want to get in, you want to get your business done, and you want to get out. Um, but it's not because of the space, it's because of the way, the mindset that we have about uh, customer service and treating customers. Uh, and it's really, in my mind, driven by the fact that we put so much work, not so much work, but we ask team members to do things that they are not good at, so that work turns into things that get uh, procrastinated about or things that don't get done as efficiently as they possibly can. Um, instead of just putting people in seats where they can be highest and best versions of themselves in the way of expressing fantastic customer service because they have the mind space to do it, right? You take, we need to stop. In the multifamily space, we need to stop asking people to do things at the site level that they are not good at. I'm talking about financials, variance notes, forecasting, owner's reports, all of it, all of it, it all needs to go away, it needs to go away, computers on desk, take them off, probably managers, assistant managers, a lot of people in, in this space, in the multifamily space, they, they nest, they sit in that chair, they make it really comfortable around them, they get busy on the computer, and some of it's work, some of it's not, trust me, some of it's not, a lot of it's not, <laughs> or they get caught up in the phone. But we design the space such that people just get comfortable. You need to get all that stuff out of the, the businesses off, business offices and put people in positions where they can be highest and best versions of themselves uh, so they can serve your customer well. Treat them well. That is our team members. We will treat the customers well, but design it such that they can do so. Take care. We'll talk to you again soon.